It's Zala the Husky in his first Friday! So this is what happens to your living room when you have a puppy, right? <laughs> it gets messy. We tried to do Fan Friday outside today, but it's really, really windy. Hi, Upside Down Oakley. Cheryl wants to know if Memphis has howled yet. Shelby and Oakley need to give her lessons. Well, let's see if I can get Shelby to sing to see what will happen. Well, that wasn't really a howl. It was close, but it wasn't quite what we were looking for. Hey, don't eat that stuff. I have heard her howl, so I know she can do it. Eventually, I'm sure she'll do it just as good as these two. Marianne wants to know if we've ever had a male dog. Nope, we've never had a boy dog. We've always had girl dogs. Hi, upside down Oakley again. Saval wants to know, do huskies have a mind of their own, or do they want to please you, and do they like to cuddle? Yes, they like to cuddle. Shelby's a couch cuddler. So far, Memphis is a pretty good couch cuddler. Oakley likes to lean when she, when it's on her terms, but she's not a big time cuddler. As for having a mind of their own, uh, yeah, they're not very eager to please. They'd rather do what they want to do on their terms. Like sometimes when you tell them to sit, they don't necessarily want to sit. They'll sit when they feel like it. So unlike like labs and golden retrievers who are really happy to do what you ask them to do, huskies don't always care to do what you ask them to do. A lot of you have been asking if we're going to do treat videos, more treat videos with Memphis. Yes, we are going to be doing more treat videos soon. As soon as things down here calm down a little bit. Maybe when the new baby gets a little bit more mature. Right? Right? Kristen says, it seems like Oakley is keeping her distance. Is she more in the curiosity stage, whereas Shelby is more the okay, you want to play, let's do it mode? Well, um, uh... Yes. Oakley has played with the puppy a few times, but she's more excited just to sit over here and watch these two. She gonna get ya! She gonna get ya! She gonna get ya! We get this question a lot. Judy wants to know, how do you keep your huskies from jumping or climbing your fence? Mine can escape any yard. You guys have seen our yard. We have a six foot high privacy fence. We do not leave the dogs outside unattended. Pretty much, that's the only way we can guarantee they're not going to get out of the yard. Even if we're not standing outside with them, we're watching them out the window. We don't leave them outside unattended because it would be really easy for them to escape if they wanted to. Brian wants to know, what's the difference between a Siberian Husky and an Alaskan Malamute? Well, Malamutes are much larger than Huskies. What are you doing, silly girl? Malamutes have a bigger build, they have a much bigger head, and their whole body in general is a lot bigger than husky. They're more muscular. Malamutes were actually designed to pull lots of weight. Uh, not go very long distances, but to be able to pull a lot of weight, like a freight sled, I guess you could say. Whereas huskies were designed to go for very long distances. They're more built for stamina. They can run and run and run and go and go and go for like 30 miles a day without issue. They were meant to be able to carry light weight over long distance. So those are a few of the differences between huskies and malamutes. They do have a lot of similarities. Um, huskies tend to be more independent and free-spirited than malamutes. Malamutes are a little bit calmer. Not always, but sometimes. What are you eating now? In the mail today, we got a photo and a coloring and a drawing from Kayla and Katie. And we got a letter and a drawing from Zoe. Zoe. And we got a photo and a letter from YouTube user HuskyGirl4059. Husky Girl and Zoe both want to know if Huskies can make good service dogs. I think we've answered this a few times. Yes, there have been Huskies as service dogs. Dog. And we got a drawing from somebody who says they're Shelby's number one fan. And look. They gave all the dogs personalities. Oakley's a librarian, Shiloh's a princess, and Shelby's a clown. Yeah, that's about right. They also want to know how old Memphis is. Memphis is 10 weeks old uh, today, actually. 
And we got a photo of Millie Kay's Husky Puppy Bear. And look at a drawing of Memphis. I noticed a lot of you guys noticed she had the same purple collar as Shelby, and now I have a new collar. This, the collar she's wearing is actually Shelby's collar from when she was a puppy. So now Memphis does have her own collar now. And we got a drawing and a letter from Hannah. Look, baby Memphis. You got the colors pretty close on, too. That's pretty cool. Thanks to everybody who sent letters in the mail this week. We will be writing everybody back. That's all we have for Fan Friday today, you guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And we'll see you on Monday.